Hi guys, with seven days remaining for the CAT exam, this is a very very important time. All my life, I have become active to the last seven days. I used to study only on the last day, but I used to become serious in the last seven days for the exam. So those who think that time will come back, that it will not come back, this and that, please understand we have got still have got seven days. All my life we have studied not more for more than one to two days. So seven days is very good time. Now. If you're not confident of the exam, you will never feel confident about the CAT exam. CAT is a kind of exam. CAT is like Bali. In Ramayan, ba Bali was there. Whoever come in front of Bali, his power will become half. So CAT will obviously take out all your energy in you, and you are just waiting for the exam to happen. So in this video, I want to make your strategy so that we can get 90 percentile in the CAT exam. Fine. Those who already scoring 90, then your target should be 99. First of all, let's understand 90 percentile mean you only need to do 15 question correct. In quant, six question correct in DI logic, and another fifteen question correct in the verbal section because DI is difficult. The cutoff will be lower. Fine. So to reach that target, fifteen question correct, I have to attempt a good number of question. So today, those are feeling down. कि मेरा नहीं आ रहा है. So everybody who is scoring sixty to seventy marks today in your CAT mocks, you can easily touch one hundred, one twenty marks in seven days, if you prepare well. So point number one. Is make a strategy. Strategy is very very important. For example, I am scared of verbal. Verbal is my weakest area. Upper say I am engineer who are not very great in verbal. Upper say I am a Punjabi because the moment you go north, the quality of verbal goes down. The moment I land in Punjab, even today I start calling America America. Automatically the tone changes. Everything changes into America. America वाली चाची आई कि नहीं आई. Take all those kind of things. So coming to the picture is suppose verb is my weakest area. If I strategize accordingly, that the one hour I'm going to feel sad in the verbal section. Quant I can handle, DL logic I can handle, but verb is my weakest area. So what I recommend is theta question I can handle because there's no negative marking. I have no problem doing the theta question. So let's start the paper with the theta question. First twenty minutes I'm going to break the paper into time wise into three sections. First I'll do the theta question. Then I'll do RCs which are easy to read. RC is my main problem because I can't understand RC. Fine. So let's do the easy RC first. All the reading based RC, all the business based RC. Last year there was an article on iPhone. That article easy to read. If you are a phone followers, if you have a phone, you will be and love to read those kind of RCs. If you can read well, obviously you can attempt more. So number two, I'll pick up RCs which are easy for twenty minutes. Last twenty minutes I'm going to feel sad while doing the. Uh, history based RCs, all the non RCs. So rather than feeling sad for one hour, I am now down to feeling sad for only twenty minutes. So I've strategized myself in such a way that I'm feeling sad only for twenty minutes. So like this, you have to strategize yourself for quant, verbal, logic. It'll take you five mocks to finalize a strategy, and we'll focus on that strategy. Okay. So number one point is make a strategy. Do not make your strategy go 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 bad on the exam day. I have seen good good students who are scoring ninety nine percent in the mocks, but actually they scored eighty five to ninety percentile, because they could not adjust them to to the exam pressure. So number one, make a strategy. Number two is the last year papers. I have passed my four years of engineering by doing last year's papers. So same thing here. Cat last year paper is available online. Please download the paper. It's available on ctking dot com slash cat also. Please download the last year paper and solve that. I want you to focus all your energies on to solving these kind of questions which are coming in the CAT exam. Those who have not not yet solved the paper, trust me, you have no idea what kind of paper is going to come in the exam. Last three years, same kind of paper is coming. So I want you to solve those papers of last years. There are two uh, section available, so slot one, slot two. I want you to solve these papers so that we understand what kind of question is coming. Trust me, even if you can do that much. You will understand, or I can channelize all my energy into solving these kind of questions. That's the number two point. Fine, make a strategy. Number one, number two is do all the uh, do the last year paper. All right. So if you have the further go down, two thousand fifteen, sixteen, fourteen, उससे अच्छा do nineteen ninety to two thousand paper for quant and verb because that's a typical level of verb and quant you are going to expect in the exam this year as well. So doing the last year paper is a must do activity. You will automatically see your scores going up. Now let's talk about the quant section first. So quant section, you will find twelve to thirteen questions which are very very easy. Download the last video, you understand what I'm trying to say. Your target is to identify those twelve thirteen questions. Your percentile will touch eighty percentile plus 
only if you are doing the easy question. Easy means solve example ka level. Last year CAD paper there were 12 questions which were as easy as a solve example. So let's target them first, do them first. Then all the medium question and then the difficult question. So if you are creating students you have our login ID password go through all the shortcuts which are there in your login ID. So all the lectures which I have connected in the class, e-class is available online so go through them. So the moment you are able to handle easy and medium difficult question ko nikal do, forget about them, you can easily cross 90 percentile in the quant section which is supposed to be the most difficult section for non-engineers. What will we cover that I am going to do theta first, this, that first. Your target is to do 15 question correct. To do 15 question correct, you might have to attempt 20 or 25 depending upon your accuracy in the exam. So fine, suppose my accuracy is 80%. So if my, if my accuracy is 80%, this means to get 15 question correct, I have to do minimum 23. So after 24, I do 6 wrong, 5 wrong, minus karke, because of negative marking and all, karte bite karke, I'll, my score will be 15 plus. I can easily get 90 percent time. Fine. Now what will happen in DI logic section? Because DI logic is the most difficult set of the exam and the student will become overconfident towards the last day. For example, if I'm doing 10 question attempt and getting 7 right, out of every 10 question I'm getting 7 right, my accuracy is 70 percent. Brilliant. Last day what he will think, if I do 30 question attempt, so my accuracy being 70 percent, I'll get 21 right. My score will touch 99.9 percent time. This is not gonna happen. If you are scoring 10 correct, 10 attempt, 7 correct, till last date, exam wale din wohi hone wala hai. You cannot change overnight. So rather than over attempting on the day, do not change your strategy on the last day. I want you to fix up a strategy and follow that. Are with me? So DA logic will be very difficult. If it is very very difficult, attempt low. So be prepared. If it is a difficult set, I have to attempt low. So it's called now always prepare for the worst and expect the best. So let's prepare for the worst. That it is difficult, I'll handle. If it's easy, obviously I score more marks. Okay. So these are the section by section. So quant, verbal. For DA logic, you will find lot of sets which are new type of question. So all the mock, just go through the different kind of question. You need to do two set right. To get 90 percent plus we'll make a few questions wrong as well chalega you'll get 90 plus for sure so our overall attempt should be either three sets or four sets don't do more than that if you're attempting three to four sets you can easily touch 90 percent yeah all i know is one thing that out of two lakh people giving the cat exam almost sixteen thousand people will get a call from ims your target is very simple to be among the sixteen thousand people so out of 2 lakh people, 1 lakh people are given the exam for time pass. If your friend have given the exam last year, or me, maybe you have given the exam last year, you also understand that most of people were doing time pass. So they moved them to the competition. So competition left is only 1 lakh people. So out of this 1 lakh people, 50% people have lost their hopes. If your friend, just call your friend and ask him, he'll say no. The moment you see, look at the word I am, you start getting scared. Fine. So gone are the days when 99% level was required to get the IM call. Now 90 will be call aega. All we want you to do is target one IM call. This was my mantra from day one. I just want to be in the top 16,000. Because the moment you get that, you will start getting the IM calls. Last year, IM Ahmedabad also have given the call at 89 percentile. Fine, so gone are the days that 99.93 needs, this needs, this it's all over now. So you will get start getting iron calls at 90 percent time. So that should be your first target. If already scoring 90, let's target 99. That's a different issue. But let's first target 90 percent time. Fine. So from quant point of view, do the sol solve example, pick up the easy question first. You will clear 90 percent time easily. Mock strategy should be according to that. Make a mock study according to that. For verbal section, you have to go topic wise, theta, this, that, and then perform accordingly to get 15 question correct. 90 percentile is a very scary term and the mocks which are giving from most of coaching classes are more difficult than the actual paper. Okay. So all I know is rather than look at the percentile, let's look at the percentage required. All I need is 120 marks out of 300 to get a 90 percentile. 100 plus pay bhi aa jayega, but 90 I normally say is 120 is safe score. So to get 120 marks is only 40 percent. All you need is a 40 percent marks to get into IMS. So let's target 90 percentile first so that it's a very achievable target in seven days. 
So dear logic, look at all the new type of questions are coming. Your target is to do two sets, verbal break into parts and get 15 questions correct. For that you need to attempt around 20 to 22 depending on your accuracy. And for verbal, your task is to find all the easy questions. And you can easily touch 90 percentile in seven days. You need to be motivated, be in the game. Only 50,000 people are there in the competition. Out of 50,000, one in three will get an iron call. So let's try to be in that. Let's ride the demotivation level of the others. If you are down, you will go down. You have to focus on it. So you have enough time. Let's keep the motivation high for the last few days. So download the last year paper and next one week, let's focus on that. So on seatingin.com, I also uploaded seatingin.com slash cat. I uploaded a, a cat fact file. Cat fact file gives you all break out all the topics. Start doing that. You have already done a lot of topics. Just revise most of them so that we can easily score that. So 40% marks here. Yeah, 10, 12 graduation you scored much more than that. And now we are feeling scared of even 40%. So let's focus on that. Alright. So all the best. Thank you.